Hello everyone, so the Dog 2, welcome to another mod overview, this time on World Height 512, a mod that simply increases the World Height to 512 blocks. Uh, there is also a booster, which I don't know if this is only for developers or not, but uh, it adds also the ability to do, I assume, a bit more with um, the actual build height. Um, so let's just see here. Uh, has allowed modders to increase the such and such. This mod goes further. The ground now begins at 300. I guess it changes the ground level, I assume, instead of being like the 60 ish range. Uh, whilst this one just pretty much increases the world height to 1, uh, 512, and that's it. As you can see, I'm at 512 here, got the cobble there, and I'll just drop all the way down to where 256 is, because I've also marked it. There we go. And as you can see, even further down to the 60 ish range that it sometimes can be. So there we go. So yeah, you can now build up to the 512 uh, height limit instead of 256 to allow a lot more for your builds um, to be much higher than usual. Um, other than that, that's pretty much it. Um, I guess the other thing to note is that pretty much tells you that it's a 512 now instead of 256 with the this is the build, build limit sort of message. Um, other than that, that's basically it. Uh, now I haven't tried the booster one yet, so I'll have to go into another sort of instance for that. But um, yeah, and while I could separate the mods, not, they kind of do go together. And I'm not sure if there's anything I can showcase in the other one just yet, so I thought I'd cover this one at least for now, as so I can at least showcase it pretty easily. Um, so let's wait until we make our way up, which is quite a ways up. In any moment now, we'll reach the top. Now I don't know if this changes for dimensions as well. I think it's probably just the overworld. As you can see, we've got the build up there. Um, we'll go down and get some obsidian. And we'll see if we can increase... Um, let's see if the build height is increased for other dimensions. I don't think it has, but I'm curious. Because I don't know if the nether will change in this to like a 256 or a 512 as well. I guess it's only the overworld though. Before checking out the booster one. So let's see. I'll just go straight up from here. We're at level 69. Okay. And let's see. Let's see if we can get any further than 128 at all. So let's see. Okay. I mean, technically, we do have to work out the. Uh, Build height of 256 here, so we'll have to see what happens when we reach that first. Okay, so we're any moment now. And let's see. Oops, too far. Okay, so 512 does apply here as well, it seems. Uh, we'll just go straight up. Oh. But uh, either way, it seems like it does apply there, and we'll check the end as well. I'm assuming it should. I don't know if the end ever did have a build limit, like the never did, or just, oh sorry, generation limit, I guess, would also be the case, um, with it being to uh, 128. But um, yeah, other than that, I assume it probably does work across all. Oh dimensions, um, probably vanilla at least, dimensions and um, everything else, because you know, each model obviously have its own set ones, but uh, I assume with maybe the booster or so, maybe you could configure that, um, I'm not sure, but uh, yeah. Oh, come on, almost there. I probably won't go to the end though. We'll just go to the booster and see what happens, because I'm assuming the same is going to happen. If it works in the nether, it's going to work in the end, most likely. So yeah, we'll just wait for this, and we're at the build limit. Cool. And we'll just end it here. Go out, and then we'll go to the world height one, which I think I needed this, correct? Um, 
At least for like going for a newer version, I think is probably what I'm going to do. Also, this is only for following snapshot here. This is for the newer one. At the time of making this video, at least. Um, so just down like this. Yes. Still getting used to mod modrinth. Okay, so we need this. We need this, and we'll see what happens. I don't know if it will work for me. Because the last time I tried, it didn't work, at least for that snapshot. So we'll find out what happens. I'm loading it. No. Oh. Oh, that's too far. No, oh, not updating. No, okay, it's updated. It's just that it wasn't displaying the other. Usually, it transitions from like, oh yeah, I'm not using this one today to the other one. So I don't know. Weird. Strange. Okay. So we'll go in here. Go in here. And I don't know if that means that there is configs per chance. I think there is. There is a world gen booster one here. So we go to 25 as well. We don't have one there. So the booster one does allow you to configure stuff. Okay. Which is just setting the world height itself in the config. Okay. So the other one is just it's going to set it regardless. Also, it's when you have control over it. Um, so that's fine. Um, hang on, is that an existing world? Yes, it is. I might create a new one just to see what happens because it would technically um, change it to what we want to to see if it actually does do the whole 300 from the start, I think it said. Uh, ground now begins at 300 blocks, yep. So, yeah. So I guess it's probably kind of like the um, uh, Traveler's Dream or something, I think it is. Um, super flat playlist, technically, in that way. Um, where it pushes a fair amount of it, uh, the ground, up higher. And then, um, obviously, you've got a bit less space, but you've got more mining potential, I guess. Um, or more stone and cave systems being expanded higher or something. Or it's just a lot more stone than the rest of the caves go. I can't remember. We'll see what happens here with the new world and see if it does actually start at 300. That we have actually a lot more than just the uh, 64 that usually, or 60 ish range of blocks on the um, surface. If this doesn't crash, of course, I don't know. I have not tested this mod yet, so we'll find out what actually happens. Um, and I've got to use mod menu, so I also don't know if you can change this in mod menu. You probably might be able to. Um, I'll try that. So, uh, doesn't seem to want to work. Okay. Hmm. I assume it's just taking its time. It is generating a lot, so we'll go and get mod menu. Right up. And we'll get a new 116. Uh, sorry, uh, 20w46a instance. Um, what about this? Now we might get, I think I've got a new one. Uh, here we go. Let's get these. Still going. Alright, I'll just create a new one of these while we're at it. And waiting. Uh, 226a. Second, I guess. I don't know. Just separate it. This. This. That for us. Cool. Um, I'm gonna probably don't even need to check this, but just to be sure, it is configurable. And while we're waiting, uh, and I could do this off camera, but you know, it shouldn't take too long. Hopefully, um, is that going to that applies to that one? Uh, that's the thing is I can't display models for. We'll just leave it at that. We'll know that the model will work soon. Should be fine. Okay, let's go up here. Hopefully. There we go. Okay. 
Uh, so two mods. No, okay, no, so you can't configure it that way. You don't know. Um, I'll probably go off camera and wait a bit because uh, it's going to take up a lot of time. So, yeah. I'll wait. Well, I've been waiting a while and it's still just sitting there. I don't think it's actually doing anything, but uh, yeah. Let's read. I don't know what that is. So, oh, actually, no, yeah. That is no, that's five graph. Whoops, not as much. Um, yeah, you can see it's still sitting here. It's doing nothing. I've checked task manager, so it doesn't do anything. So yeah, it seems to be that I can't really get this to work, unfortunately. So yeah, I might have to kill it. It probably does work. It's just I'm unable to without it struggling somewhat. Um, and I assume maybe if I reduce the World height, maybe, but then again, it starts 300 blocks, and you can't, I assume, configure that unless you're obviously a oh, mod developer in some way, probably. Um, but other than, or, or familiar, of course, with how to do things about this, of course. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. You've got a world height that just sets it for it and changes nothing else about the world, and then you've got one that actually sort of changes the height. Um, as well as other things. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye.